Not long ago, when I was on my way back home from another vacation, I had an 11 hour layover in Kiev, the capital of Ukraine. This city was on my bucket list for such a long time. Now I had finally the opportunity to visit. I'm currently at the Maidan Zaliezhnisti. It's the Independence Square in the very heart of Kiev, Ukraine. And there in the center is the Khrushchev. It's the most important street in Kiev. It's like the Times Square in New York or the Piccadilly Circus in London, the Arbat in Moscow and yeah, and the Kurfürstendamm in Berlin. As my subscribers already know, I really like post-Soviet metro systems. So of course I did a Kiev metro tour. I got off at Arsenalna. It's known to be the deepest metro station in the entire world. Arsenalna is 105 meters below the surface and it takes a little bit more than 5 minutes to get to the exit. On my way to one of the most famous sites in Kiev, I went through the park of eternal glory. If the weather is clear, you'll have a nice view over the entire city and the Dnipro river. So I'm currently at the territory of the Kiev Pichurska Lavra. I forgot the English name, but it translates like the Kievan Cave Church. It's one of the most important uh, sites in Kiev. And this building behind me is the main church building. And during the Soviet Union, it was blown up by the Soviets. That's not really true. It's unknown if the church was destroyed by the Soviets or the soldiers of the German Wehrmacht. I confused the Lavra with the St. Michael's Golden Domed Monastery, which was demolished in the 1930s after Kiev became the capital of the Ukrainian SSR. In the 1990s, both the Kiva Pichurskaya Lavra and the monastery were reconstructed. And during the Soviet Union, it was blown up by the Soviets and that's the newly built church. I guess it was built in the 90s of the last century. Yeah, that's it. In the evening, I went to the Motherland Monument. I took the wrong metro station to get there. On my way, I found a park with an exhibition of Chinese New Year sculptures. The Motherland Monument, in Ukrainian, but Kivshina Mate, was built to celebrate the victory of the Soviet Union over Nazi Germany. The height is approximately 102 meters. <laughs> 